Okay, hi everyone. So we are here at Holy Grounds. This is my friend Lydia. She's going to be my um, my camera lady. And uh, we're actually on Holy Grounds now. We have uh, uh, arrived to get the farrier to attend to one of the horses. And I'm also going to do some body work on them later on. But Lydia is going to be my camera lady to film all of that. So right now, and he's getting the halter on her to take her to the farrier. So uh, let's watch what happens. I approach Sophia. She's waiting to greet me. However, her greeting is very um, short. She doesn't quite trust people that easily. And the other horses, this is Rebecca. She approaches Lydia. And um, you'll find the other horses now gathering shortly to come and greet. That's Bella. Bella Sabrina. She's a little upset that Mary is eating carrots and she wants some. No fighting. No fighting, Bella. No fighting. You also want carrots. And you'll she see she lifts, she's lifting her foreleg. That's her way of saying she wants carrots. And she's with her foal, Phoebe. And the white, or the grey horse that's um, on the other side is Princess. And her foal is with her, which is Rebecca. And her second foal is Victoria Spirit. He's around as well. But this is the behaviour of the horses when I'm around. They will always come to say hello and uh, bond a little oh, I don't know hugs and kisses <laughs> and um, they will then go about their grazing. <laughs> so as you can see the horses have all gathered around us and um, we're just needing to get a halter to get the farrier uh, sorted. And there's Amon busy trying to get the horses to be socialized with him. Hey JJ. Hey Tulipi. Oh, you're looking at me. <laughs> <laughs> How's my Tulipi? <laughs> my Tulipi. Hey big girl. Phoebe. This is JJ. This is our big boy. <laughs> the door. <laughs> the mares, Bella Sabrina and Princess Camilla, as well as Sophia, are all pregnant. Tulip is also suspected to be pregnant. How's my boy? How's my boy? Don't fight with her, okay? No fight. Uh, 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 JJ. Uh, uh, uh. JJ. No. No, no, no. Don't be naughty. <laughs> Tulipi. You could go. Yeah, you could go. Yeah, you could go. Okay, so Amon is struggling to get uh, the halter. Ah, oh, hello George! George has been taking care of the horses for a few months and he's just now come out to help us with um, the proper halter. Oh. Morning, how are you? Hey, Jesus. <laughs> Lydia doesn't quite interact with the horses on a regular basis, so she tends to get a little nervous around them when they approach her to greet her. Is this one is running? Yeah. This is Mary Nikita who needs to get her hooves seen to um, and shoes replaced in the forelegs 
and she's not very trusting. She's a bit of a loner as well and um, it's been quite a few years since 2017 till now that I was able to get close to her and earn her trust and until she had to have um, uh, her leg seen to, uh, she had a bit of swelling and the moment um, she is approached with a halter she tends to now run away because it reminds her of that painful experience. Whilst Amon is getting Nikita, Mary Nikita sorted out, I'm just bonding with the other horses and trying to see if I can actually start some body work with Princess Camilla or Bella or any horse for that matter who will calm down and allow me to work with them. Right now it seems as though Princess Camilla is asking me or wanting me to work with her Phoebe is trying to get acquainted with me again and it's been quite wonderful to see that Phoebe coming out of her shell, trusting me, allowing me to touch her, it's a very big step and she started doing this um, two weeks ago, little by little and we're slowly building on that relationship which is awesome. So now Princess Camilla seems to be standing quietly uh, but calm, her neck is um, lowered her head is lowered and i start with the bodywork around the bladder meridian and i'm watching her blinking and this time it's not really a full evaluation to start with i'm watching the areas where her eyes are closing and uh, that indicates that there's some deeper work that needs to be done or i need to hold my position in that area for a little longer so there may be um, underlying issues there which needs to be released. You may have noticed that as I started the work she turned her head and touched my hand which was an acknowledgement that the work has actually begun and she's okay with it. You will notice that Princess Camilla is closing her eyes quite a bit for lengthy periods of time or you know much longer and I then rest my hand or keep my hand longer on that particular spot where she is closing her eyes deeper. You'll notice the horses are not wearing any halters as I'm working with them because I believe that um, the freer they are, the easier it is to work with them. If they're restrained, they would obviously feel a lot nervous, a lot more nervous. When they feel the need to leave, I allow them to leave. And when I find them in a different state or a different position, in a resting position, I then resume the work again with them. I'm also looking to see if Princess Camilla is going to release by means of licking and chewing, snorting, sighing and breathing. But you can see whatever it was that I touched on her hind quarters was a bit too much for her to handle and so she's decided to walk away. I've given her the space that she needs to process what has happened and I resume working on her hindquarters again. Princess Camilla has come from a riding school before where she was used to train children and obviously there is some strain in her hindquarters. Since they've arrived on holy grounds all of these horses, uh, Princess Camilla Bella Sabrina, Mary Nikita and Tulip as well as Sophia, Madame Sophia, um, they have not been ridden so they have been uh, free and wild to roam and basically at leisure. So I start with Princess Camilla now on the other side and again on her neck she seemed to find it a little too much to handle. And so I allowed her the freedom to move and I tried to start all over again. Thus far she has chewed but not a lot. She's licked and chewed a little but not tremendously. She's decided that she wants to leave and so I let her. Okay, so we let her go. It was obviously a little too much on for her. Side and uh, on the other side I tried to stay a little bit longer on one of the points 
and it seems that that was a little much for her and she just needed some space so she's she's moving on um, she hasn't licked or chewed there were, didn't seem to be many issues on her on her back along the meridian so she seems to be okay but this, this young lady Lady Sarah was worked on last week on both sides and the results were tremendous. She gave three big yawns and licked and chewed as well. Madame Sophia is Lady Sarah's mom. Lady Sarah was Sophia's first foal. Her second foal is Gracie and she's now expecting a third foal. The same with Bella Sabrina. I'm trying to see if I could have her relaxed to start working with her, but she's a little too excited <laughs> and wants phone. to visit Lydia. So Bella Sabrina's first foal was Lady Delilah, and Lady Delilah sadly passed away in April. Her second foal is Phoebe, who is standing beside her, and she's now pregnant with a third foal. Yeah, check her, check Phoebe out. Looking hmm? over her mommy's back. Oh, <laughs> this one's. Uh, I'm see the, 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 the. So I'm just waiting for for Bella to lower her head a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, that will mean that she's a bit calmer, and she's not going to be picking fights with the other horses because she tends to get jealous when they're around me. <laughs> um, so no, no, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> With Rebecca. Huh? So at least Lydia, you're getting you're getting used to the horses now. <laughs> My God. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let me go. Actually, let me go and say hello to George. Okay. Yeah, um, the guy. We're going to start with the farrier work now, and then we'll speak to him just now. <laughs> Look, this is nice. She's letting me touch her. So I'll come back to you. We'll work on you just now. People are in the church, yeah? Yeah, people are in the church already. Oh. Okay, let me go say hello to George. Okay, okay.